Hey guys, how's it going? Today is a different kind of video. Today is a video about The Walking Dead, season 6, the last episode, the season finale. And, well, if you guys are not a Walking Dead fan, you do not watch The Walking Dead, or you don't even know what it is, you're probably going to want to click out of this video, because you're probably not going to know what I'm talking about. So, let's get started. Last episode of The Walking Dead, Negan killed one of these characters that you see in the screen, one of Rick's group, and we do not know who it is, but I think I can say I know who it is. Well, let's just take a look at Daryl. If you look down, you see Daryl, how he's in a coat. Well, the thing that makes me wonder is, one second, okay, the camera's focused. So, the thing that makes me wonder is, we watched, so let's just say it again. You can see how he's in this, um, Dale right there. You can see how he's in, like, this blanket. And AMC came out with a, um, trailer for The Walking Dead. And let me just find that. So I search up the Walking Dead Negan kill scene. And here it is right here, the trailer. If I'm guilty, so let me just it skip means this ad. that I am the ultimate figure to fear. Now, a sneak peek at this so let's just watch Walking this three-minute video. Actually, I'm just going to click in a little bit. So it shows Negan and Rick talking. And Negan actually pulls Rick into an RV in just a second. Maybe Rick will be with me. And if not, well, we can just turn these people inside out, won't we? Can we just turn this up a little bit? I mean, the ones that are left. Listen how he says the ones that are left. So that could mean that two people died. But look real quick. What do we see? Daryl's blanket. Right on the ground. Now, if one person died, or uh, let's just say, if Daryl didn't die, why would his blanket that was wrapped around him be on the ground? For what reason? Unless, of course, Negan picked him, and he's the one who died, which I don't think. What I think what happened is, we all know how Daryl can be a hothead sometimes, and when Beth died... He lost his temper a lot. He actually burned his hand with a cigarette. And he was wicked depressed. So, let's just say Negan picked Glenn or Maggie. Any one of those people. Daryl could have saw that one of his people were going to die. And maybe he lost his temper. Because as we saw in the episode right before the season finale of season 6. Daryl lost his temper and he went looking for Dwight. And he wanted to kill them. But what happened? He got shot. Maybe Daryl loses his temper this time. And, of course, Negan kills him. So let's just start the video. And what does it show? Guts all over the ground. Now, that's kind of creepy, of course. But let's go back right to the blanket. That is the exact same blanket that was around Daryl. And, like like I said, why would his blanket be on the ground? For no reason at all. Daryl must have done something to get himself either hurt, killed, I don't know. Maybe he was picked. I doubt it because I don't think Daryl was picked. I think that Daryl might have done something that may have gotten him hurt. I could be completely wrong, be completely wrong. That's just my theory. We don't know, but again, like why does blanket be on the ground? Now, if we look at Rick's face, there's blood on his face, and that blood was not there in the season finale. There was no blood on his face, so maybe someone obviously near him was hurt. Now, Maggie was sitting right next to him. Maggie was very hurt. 
and maybe he killed her, but he didn't need any mini mo. It could have been a coincidence that he picked her. Maybe Maggie got killed and the blood splattered, or Abraham, because Abraham was near him, and the blood splattered on Rick, and that could have caused Daryl to lose his temper, go on an outrage, and get himself killed. But do I think Daryl died? I'm really not sure. Like, I, I, I do think he died, but, like, I don't want to say he did because he is, like, my, my all-time favorite character on the show. He's the reason why I love watching this show. So, just to show you guys, let's go back. Let's see if I can find a scene before. For example, look at right here, as you can see. Look at Rick's face. There's no blood splatter on his face. So that must have mean that the blood splattered on him. And, like I said, Daryl probably lost his temper. I really think Daryl lost his temper because he can be a hothead sometimes. But he's still my favorite character. Another thing is, let's look at Negan's bat. That is a whole lot of blood. Could that all be from one person? I mean, it definitely could be from one person, but I do not see one spot on that bat where there is not a blood mark. That whole bat is covered in blood. Now, again, that could have been two people getting hit because he said in the beginning... Uh, not in the beginning, actually, when he pulled Rick into the van. He says, be right back. the ones Where's that are left. And if not, well, we can just turn these people inside out, won't we? I mean, the ones that are left. Yes, the ones that are left. So that, again, him saying that could mean two people died. It doesn't necessarily mean two people died, but it's... Definitely kind of trying to say that maybe two people could have died. We don't exactly know. Now, that is it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.